Right, when I first started making nets, there was only two choices of twine that you could use. And th that was the full Z nylon, that you can see there, and there was hemp. And then came along spun nylon, and also these brightly coloured twines. Uh, these are some of my homemade nets, by the way. But it just goes to show you the, the advantages of these brightly coloured nets. Um, great in bad weather or low visibility. And also, from a distance, they stand out really well. So you're not going to, you know, the chances of leaving a net behind are very slim. Whereas the 4Z nylon from here, you can see the difference between the 4Z nylon and them coloured purse nets. They really stand out. And also, um, a few of you are probably thinking, uh, you know, these brightly coloured nets, um, you know, a rabbit's not going to bolt out into one of these brightly coloured nets. But you can take it from me, uh, the colour of the net doesn't make a slight bit of difference um, because when the rabbit is coming out of the burrow entrance it's, it's going to be silhouetted anyway they're all going to appear black doesn't matter what colour um, net it is they're all going to be black to the rabbit and also being that the rabbit's uh, you know getting chased out of the uh, burrow you know to save his, its own life it's not going to stop and, and worry about the colour of the net so that's it. It's just a quick video just so you can see the advantages of these brightly coloured purse nets.